When did this place get so messy? There's my to-do list. Oh, I really need to become more organized. Hi, I'm Adrithi from HubSpot, and I'm here to talk to you all about HubSpot tasks. Now, I love HubSpot tasks for three main reasons. One, it's a really easy to use platform. I don't have to figure out how to use yet another software. Two, it's super transparent. I can see everything assigned to me, my coworkers can assign me tasks, and I can assign out other tasks as well. And finally, it's free. Who doesn't love anything free? Come, I'll show you how it works. Now, there are two ways to create tasks, manually and automatically. You can create automatic tasks if you have a paid subscription to HubSpot via workflows. But today, we're going to focus on the manual creation of tasks. So in your HubSpot account, navigate to Sales and click Task. Now you'll immediately be taken to the dashboard where you can see all the tasks that are assigned to you or anyone else. You have filters up here so that you can see who the task is assigned to, the type of task, the due date, and more. Now to create a task in the top right, select create task and give your task a title. As you can tell, the type automatically switch to call based on the title, but you can also change it to to do or email. And something that I really, really recommend you folks use is priority. Priority is really what tells me where I need to start my day. I look at all my tasks with high priority and start there. Now, because HubSpot task is so ingrained with your CRM, you can associate the tasks with any records that you have in your CRM, such as contacts, companies, tickets, and more. So let's associate this with Marie and I'm gonna assign it to myself. And something that I also love about HubSpot is its queues. So I like a queue because I can lump together all of my related tasks. Let's say I really just wanna get through all of my calls at once. I don't wanna be going back and forth between call and email. I can create a call queue where it just lists out all of the calls that I need to make. So I don't have to kind of go back and forth between calling and email or whatever it might be. Of course, you set the due date for 9 a.m. And you can also make sure that the task reminders are emailed to you so you don't necessarily have to live out of your CRM if you don't want to. And yeah, let's click create. Now in this view, I would really like to see those notes that I just left just so I have a holistic view right from the get-go. So I can actually edit columns and add in notes so I can see them right away. Okay, perfect. Now, this view is a little overwhelming. And for that, we have filters. So a place that I recommend you start your day is assigned to me and priority is high. Perfect. Now you can even get more granular by saying all of the high priority tasks that are due today, overdue, or upcoming. For me, for right now, I think I just wanna see the tasks that are in my name and that I have a high priority. So this is perfect. Now to get started in completing my tasks, all I need to do is click into the task and you'll notice the record looks eerily familiar, right? It kind of looks like the contact company records that we have in HubSpot. So again, there's no need to learn yet another tool. So if we just scroll down, we can see everything we need to know about this person who's associated with this task. I have the phone number here, so I can make the call directly from HubSpot if I want to. If for some reason I can't complete the task, I could always reassign the task or leave a note making sure I tag the appropriate people, letting them know why I couldn't complete this task. And when I'm done with this task, all I click is the skip or the next button and I'm on my way to my next task. Easy. Now, the last thing that I wanna talk about regarding tasks is the reporting functionality that comes along with it. So in your overall dashboard, if you click add report and let's create a report. Now you can create a report from scratch if you'd like, but we have a ton of templates. So I always recommend starting there. So simply type in tasks and let's see what we're working with. All right, so we can see what tasks are due and assigned to me, incomplete tasks, and a ton of others. This is a great resource for managers to have in one-on-ones with their sales reps just to make sure that they're on track for hitting their numbers. 
Now, I highly recommend adding these reports to your dashboard so that as a manager, you can see who on your team is on track to hitting their numbers and who might need a nudge. Now, if you're ready to be even more productive as a sales rep and close more deals, sign up for HubSpot's free CRM today.